So yeah, um, hi guys, I'm back from another video, and this is um, Tiara is what's my name, and some other things as well. I actually forgot what was in this. I think there was a newest album in here as well. I forgot. I forgot it, if it if this had three um, albums or two. But yeah, I just know that there's a Tiara and a newest one, which are like really booming right now since Tiara just won for the first time in five years. And New East is actually nominated for Inkigayo. So yeah. I'm not gonna be talking about the Plutus 101 um, um, results here, but seriously, I'm kind of actually okay with it. I'm like, of course, I wanted like my boys to um, get in, but then it's a win win situation, except that. Um, so, actually, ah, yeah, I actually got the Infinite H as well. <laughs> so, I got Infinite H. On fly high. Surprisingly, I don't have this album, even though I'm a uh, Hoya stan. Then I have um, New East Sleepers. This is like their only mini album, I think, that's not the same size as their others. But I feel like, or maybe it is, I don't know. It just has like a cover. Then Tiara's What's My Name. I'm gonna be doing this first because this was the pre order. And I was actually really looking forward to this. So this is um Tiara's What's My Name. Um we have um Gion and Curie there. And, like very old fashioned photos um styling. We have Human and Onjong. Onjong is my bias. Then here is the ah, there's I think this is their last um comeback under MBK. By December all of the remaining members will have their um, contracts up and we'll never know what happens. I'm just hoping that they move on to a different uh, company just because they're really big in Japan and disbanding them would be, I think, a wrong decision. So when you open this, yeah, what's my name, Tiara? Pretty um, plain TV, I'm not gonna remove it just because I don't think there's something in the back. Yeah, this it's just the blue thing. Then we have the photo book, which yeah, it's not in um landscape. But I'm gonna remove the card first. I'm really hoping for an Unjong card, although I pre-ordered her version as well. So yeah. How many cards are you supposed to get here? So I feel like I got a group card because there's four signatures. <laughs> So, Tiara, what's my name? Let's just zoom out a bit. It's gonna be like full of glare though. We have Curie the leader. She looks so grown up now. Like, she used to be one of the fake Magnus, but now she's like grown up. Is that a Versace? I don't know really. Wow, I'm loving these photos. And we have um, Hyomin, and we have the ones with the crowns. I love, like, I feel like it's kind of like old Hollywood ish, but not really. Then we have Hyomin and Jiyeon. I love the shots with the um, crowns though. I feel like I got a human card. But the one I feel like is because I saw black hair and Unjong has like brown hair, so I don't think it's her. Unjong looks so sexy here. I'm loving these um, hair shots. These are focus, right? I hope they are. Oh, I love this. Although I feel I really, really, really miss Unjong with short hair. I think that's the best look for her. I chose her face very well. Like, even in this kind of like hairstyle, it breaks so well for her. Short, like, bob hair. We have Gion.
There you have. So yeah, that was that was it. So I actually pre-ordered Unjong's version, so I'm gonna be getting that at a later date just because um yes Asia for like some reason had it on a different release date. So here's the back of the card. It's very flimsy though. One, two, three. Oh I got a group card. I got um Hyomin and Dion. So <laughs> none of these girls are my bias. So yeah, I'm willing to trade for the Curie and Unjong one. And, or an Unjong um, solo card, but I'll be buying a signed version of this one as well. So yeah, maybe I don't know what to do with this right now. So yeah, um, that's it. Um, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!